Hey guys, Trevor here, and in this video, I'm gonna show you how to unlock your Mint Mobile phone. It's pretty quick and easy, so let's jump right in. Now, the first, basically check out this link down below. My partner, Mint Mobile, gave it to me. It gives you a great discount off of their plans. Now, there are a couple of different things that you can check to see if you have a locked phone, and then I'll walk you through steps to unlock it. So let's open up your settings here and tap on cellular. So under cellular data, if you have cellular data options on there, that's a good indication that your phone is unlocked. However, if it's not there, then potentially your phone is still locked. That's one place to look. Another place to look is let's go back, scroll down, tap on general, and then about. And if I scroll down here, you can see carrier lock at the very bottom and it says no SIM restrictions. So essentially it will tell you if the carrier, Mint Mobile or any other carrier, T-Mobile, Verizon, Sprint, at and all of those, if they have locked your specific phone. Now, if you go through all this step and it is locked and you need to unlock it, basically you just need to contact the carrier itself. So I can open up the Mint Mobile app here and then just tap on support. And there's a couple different options. One is I can hit this chat with us and I can chat with them directly in the app itself. Or I can just call this number 800-683-7392. And then basically I can get somebody on the phone, walk them through the steps that I need to unlock my phone. And they will go through the process of unlocking it as long as you don't owe any balance on your physical phone itself. Now, if you're trying to unlock any other carrier, basically just go to Google, type in AT&T unlock phone, Verizon unlock phone, any of those different things, and it'll walk you through the steps. Usually you almost always have to either chat with them or call them, and then they'll go through the process of unlocking it. Hope this helps. If you have any questions on that, leave them in the comments down below, and I'll catch you on the next one.